so i don't know even how to start this one but okay let's get into it yes i'm heady prefect as usual with another youtube tutorial and today i'll be talking about this instagram new 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 application called the igtv a lot of people there are thinking how will they upload the uh, videos that are in horizontal or landscape mode and um, this is the way now let's get into it without wasting more any time so first of all i'll show you a video that we are going to use i've downloaded it somewhere this video first of all you have to make sure you know the dimension of the videos it is in what 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 form for example this video that we are going to use it has 1280 by 720 pixels that's the dimension in other ways around you can just call it 720p a video is in a quality of 70 7, 720 pixels so in order to, to to upload these videos and look at as it is on your instagram television that's igtv you will have to reverse the dimensions instead of reading as you can see here it reads 1280 by 720 it has to read 720 by 1280 and that's the only technique that you can do so without wasting any more time let's get into premiere pro and show you how you can do that first of all you input your video that's the video this one we're going to use i input the videos and thereafter you create you may see also may, let's check again if you, you're not very happy with that let's check again on the properties the properties image size it shows here it is 1280 by 720 so in order to for it to be uploaded on instagram as a vertical video you have to transform those dimension in other ways around to reverse in other ways that it has to read 720 by 1280 so to do that you need to create a new sequence right you click your you, you and go create a new sequence from the clip thereafter the, the video will just be imported as it is we have not yet reversed this video so in order to reverse this video go up there on the top bar menu and go to sequence setting after going to sequence setting here you change the frame size now i say this has to be 720 so i'll just cut it cut it make it 720 720 and the horizontal and the here it has to be 1280 thereafter as you can see it has already adapted the features also this here but you have to reset make sure that you you change it here again here you have to let it as it is it is because it is adapting so you just reset it is 680 by 1080 so you have to just leave it as it is thereafter just click ok it says change to preview file format or to preview file frame size it requires all preview to be deleted on this operation you just click ok thereafter you see the video has changed but it is still if you play it let me play it for you it is still cut some of your parts of the video so stop the videos click this here in the control here on the editing panel go to effect go to effect Let's see, go to click here go to effect go to effect yes here oh my god i was looking around where it is go to effect control go to here go to rotation go to motion and then go to rotation on the rotation side just right 90 rotate it to 90 degree click enter as you can see the video has already rotated here it is on a vertical form and it looks as it was before so stop the video there what we do next is just to export the video go to file export your video click media click media and thereafter this is it but you have to make sure that you have to change this setting up down here i've already did that so it has no problem with that now i can export just my videos so maybe i'll just have to transfer this video to another location file location maybe let's bring it to the desktop or oh, yes let's take it to the igtv folder maybe and maybe just to rename it we can rename it somewhere it'd be final final video just to re rename it as a final video and then click ok thereafter you just come here the file size will be 46 okay no 
it's not an issue you may change this one to to the format that's mobile mobile device 720 it has now become this one but you have to change these settings again if you change the the, the, the setting the preset before it was matching the original source but now i have changed it to mobile device that's 720p now you have you will have to change this again you will have to command x 720 put it here 720 and height it has to be command v that is lucky there now it has adapted there so the key feature is to alter those settings instead of them to start with you have to change we we used it the normal ways aspect ratio is 16 by 9 but instagram reversed it to 9 by 16 thereafter i'll just have to say export now the video is being exported now so i'll have to wait for some times to post the video there wait because it's not too late that's that much long i can wait it here so actually we cannot wait for that because i have already did the video for that so let's just it finish let's go and proceed on the on some on on our other features so let's go to to to, to our web page so i will have to log in into my instagram account yes log into my instagram account after that i'll just write my username gonja gonja gfx gfx that's gonja graphics make sure you show you you, you follow me make sure you follow me on instagram gonja gfx and then in, on the password yes i'll have to put on my password there there after i will click login yes it takes some times because my internet space is not that much faster yes as you can see i've managed to log in into my instagram account yes that's my instagram account as you can see here you can see a post from monify that's my favorite artist so you you have to go to your account to to, to your profile you will see the second tag tab the second tab is called the igtv go to your igtv this is my video i did it i uploaded it one hour ago so if you want to upload your video maybe you want to upload it again just click upload thereafter you will have to drag or to double click just double click your video and thereafter i'll just go to the desktop where the videos are igtv after that igtv there is this one called e. where where is it where is it yes is it this one no no yeah not real actually is this one i'm not going to upload it because i already did that one so just come and see how how you just come and see get back just go back see the video this is the video i uploaded so maybe it should maximize my screen so that you can get to see i can play that video as you can see it looks nice so this is my username. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Mgonja JFX. That's Mgonja Graphics also. Put the link in my description so that it can be easy for you to see my other videos. So, guys, thank you. It was awesome. Thanks for this new application called JGTV. So, we have another platform to upload our videos. So, guys, shout out to everybody out there. Thank you.